Uh, this one is so film effect. On the third layer, I've added a film effect. And if I go into film effect, and I have to bring the film effect down to sort of 0.200 or 0.300 on the scale color correction, which just is the amount of color correct of film effect that you've got used that you're using the level of, of uh, uh, at 1.000 it's a full effect and 0.200 is you know is 20 percent of that so it's it's a pretty light film effect but all we want to do is bump the colors up ever so slightly but the bit that we're really interested in is down here which is down at the bottom the field dominance and field keeping the lower or upper field so we just field dominance we just leave it at lower first that's what it's preset to and on the fields just change this to keep lower only it'll be it'll be on as is as as a preset but if you keep lower only it just removes every second field and just gives you a more framed framed um, look a more filmic look so it gives people a bit more action in their motion right. uh, makes people look like they're running faster mm -hmm. when they're not um, so that's what that's the net game of a game of film effect um, I also added a little glow a slight glow so if I bump up the glow brightness that's in film effect in film effect if you bump up glow brightness oh yeah um, That'll, uh, that gives, just gives everybody a bit of a sheen mm -hmm. and uh, makes it look a bit dreamier and nicer. And that's it.